Hi guys, my name is Gia, and today I'm going to be teaching you how to find the percentages from an illustration that is given to you. Um, the key to doing this is understanding the diagram or picture that is given to you. And in this case, we will be given a grid that is a 10 by 10 grid. So you can see here there's 10 blocks that go this way and 10 blocks that go this way. So a if you multiply 10 by 10, you get 100 total. So that will help you determine the percentage shown. And you're going to write your answer as a percentage. So basically, percent means part out of 100. So if you have purple shaded here, you want to count how much purple is shaded out of the total 100. Um, to determine the percentage. So if this shape has 100 sections, as I've mentioned before, and we want to count, count how many sections are shaded purple, that will give us the percentage. So you can just do 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. So you have 70 total plus these extra ones shaded in, which is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and that equals 76. Okay, so then we write down here, the shape has 76 out of 100 shaded in, so the percentage would be 76. So now that we walk through that example, um, we can start doing them together. And each example I go through, I want you to pause the video and try to do it on your own with the method that I just showed you, and then we can work it out together. So again, try to do this one on your own, and I'm gonna do it with you guys right now. So it says, what percentage of the shape is green? So we know 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. You have 50, and then you have one, two, three, four, five, and that equals 55. So then your answer is 55% because it's out of 100. We want to write our answer, 55%. Make sure you include the percent sign and submit your answer. And that was correct. So again, do with this one. Pause the video. I'm going to go through it now. You have 10 plus 1, 2, and that equals 12. So only 12 of the 100 are shaded in. So then your answer would be 12%. Let's check our answer. And that was correct. Okay, let's try again. 10, 20, 30, 40. So you have 40 full grid shaded in plus one, two, three equals 43. And then we'll type our answer in, 43%. Again, it's 43 out of 100 shaded in. So the translation to percentage is actually super easy. And we submit it, and we get 43%. Okay, now this is going to be the last question we go through. So again, pause the video and try to practice on your own. So we have 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. You have 80 full rows, plus one, two, three, four, five, six. So your answer is 86. Let's see if that's correct. And that is. So one last thing I wanna note while this example is upwards, um, you don't wanna count the rows this way because they're not fully filled in that way. You wanna make sure that you're counting them this way down, unless it is fully filled that way. So I hope that makes sense. And I hope you guys gained a better understanding of what percentage is illustrated from different diagrams. Thanks for watching.